I am freshly come from cleaning up the chicken coop, and I gotta tell you, it was a filthy, disgusting job. While I was reaching into the chicken resting nooks, it occurred to me that cleaning the chicken coop is a great deal like replying to a Lord Shadrach video. Somebody's gotta reach in there with their bare hands, scoop up the filthy, disgusting, soiled straw, and dump it into the bucket and haul it away. That is what I feel like when I even watch a Lord Shadrach video. Fortunately, after I clean the chicken coop or watch a video from Lord Shadrach or make a reply, I can take a bath afterwards. Lord Shadrach appears to believe that he has taken the definitive creationism challenge. It appears he actually believes that he has stated a positive claim in defense of creationism. Nowhere in his videos can anyone see a positive defense stated in his video. <sighs> he appears to believe that vestigial features in the biosphere, since they still have functions, most of them, therefore they are not vestigial. Of course, vestigial features in the biosphere can and often do still have functions. That is how evolution works. That is how evolutionary, says it, uh, evolutionary theory says it works. Therefore, vestigial features in the biosphere that still have functions is a product of evolution. And that is why evolutionary theory covers those uh, still existing functions. Saying that since they still have functions, that is a positive uh, proof of creationism, is ridiculous. <sighs> For example, the coccyx. Since the great apes still have the coccyx, it is because the coccyx still performs a uh, function in the various species that aid reproductive success. It still does not mean that the coccyx is not vestigial. It is. Humans now and then are still born with tails, and they get hacked off um, when the uh, infant is born soon after. And, of course, it leaves a tail scar. These are, this is called um, atavism. And it shows that the human genome still has genes for making tails, like monkeys. And of course, apes are partly defined by the lack of tails. <sighs> the coccyx is a vestigial of uh, old world monkeys and uh, the uh, descendants of the old world monkeys, the great apes. Still, vestigial feature still has a function. Just because a vestigial is vestigial does not mean they don't have functions. Therefore, uh, Lord Shadrach's bizarre uh, claims has absolutely nothing to do with stating a positive claim for creationism. I find it very, very amusing that in his video he states that he can't refute that claim. The reason one can't refute it is because that is what evolutionary theory states, not creationism. <sighs> now I must shower.